Accra's main political parties are reaffirming the commitment to actively participate in the presidential election in October 2025. The Rassemblement des Oupetis, Pour la Démocratie et la Paix, continues to rally voters around the potential candidature of the al Green presidency, Alassane Ouattara. As part of the Parti Démocratique de Côte d'Ivoire, Rassemblement Démocratique Africain, Tijani Tiam, a technocrat and former banker, seems to be emerging as the national candidate for the old party with the legacy of the late Henry Canan. The declared and potential candidates, in particular Laurent Bagbo, are putting forward clear and ambitious programs in order to attract the voters. Laurent Bagbo, despite his current ineligibility, has been nominated by the PPACI and is proposing a nationalist vision for the country's recovery. Charles Blé Godet, who is also ineligible, has made no secret for his ambition to be the country's leader and has proposed measures to combat corruption and improve the justice system. Guillaume Soro, who is exiled, also wants to become president, although his political future is uncertain due to legal problems. The presidential election in 2025 remained a crucial moment for Ivory Coast, which is still recovering from the crisis that followed the 2013-2011 elections. Political stability and continued economic and social development of this African country remains major challenges.